What's going on, everybody? We are back. Snakes Miss Prime here with more Final Fantasy X. And we're running around with this guy. That's what we're doing. Uh, ah. Alright, man. What's up, buddy? I'm gonna be a Blitzball when I grow up. Yeah? Alright, cool, man. You wanna be a Blitzball? You can be a Blitzball, bro. Alright. No matter how bad it gets, I ain't moving. I'm with you. I'm with you. Still sleepy? Everyone else has already left. Alright, so invisible all of plot. Not letting me go up there. That's fine though, we don't have to go up there. Alright. So let's see what the town of Kilika has to offer. Something. Yeah, I hear you, bro. Hey, people we're out here helping out though. Well, Lock is waiting for you. Okay. Good man. Good man. Well done, sir. Aww. Okay. Back in here. Okay. That's up to you. Hello. Hello. Out bed primer. Nice, nice. Okay, guys. So, I would like to let everybody know, in case anybody hasn't, that I will be doing the Kingdom Hearts 1.5 and 2.5 HD Remix in its entirety on Twitch uh, a couple nights a week. So, you know, if you guys see this and you're, you're in on that for right now, by all means, you know, let's, uh, let's hang out. Let's converse a little bit. I'd like to get to know some of the people that are watching my stuff. Even though most of the people that watch my stuff already know me. But for those that don't, you know, definitely uh, hop on. Say what's up, you know. Bam. Gotta go to the temple. used to live in the Kilika temple here. Yep. Lord O'Hallon was once a great blitzer, you know? Great blitzer. Hmm? Praying for victory is so good. <sighs> but is this right? Something wrong with enjoying blitzball? Is this really the time? Yeah. This is the only time. The players fight with all their strength. The fans cheer for their favorite team. They forget pain, suffering. Only the game matters. Yeah, that's makes why sense. Blitz has been around for so long. At least that's what I think. Whatever you say. Yeah. Let's play and win, right? All right, right. fine. Yeah. Temples beyond the jungle. There. Let's go. All right, to the jungle. Okay. Alright. Well, let's make our way to the jungle. Yep. So, so it's in here? Oh, man. Bro. What are you looking at? It ain't, I ain't on this layer. Oh, well, fine. Be that way, bro. Yeah, affected by toxins. Yeah, I, I. Oh, there was a chest back there. Bad, bad sneezemus. Bad sneezemus. Get the chest. All right, there you go. Three potions. Hey, you never know when they're gonna come in handy, you know. All right, guys. Here we are. The jungle. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Yeah, let's just kind of get that going. Okay. What's up? What's Luna's up? Luna's saying she wants you with us. Huh? Oh, I want boy. to ask you to be my guardian. You know what? There's no time for jokes, yeah? 
He may be a blitzball whiz kid, but up against fiends, he's a newbie. Not a guardian, then. I just want him nearby. What? Aww. What? What do you mean? It's just that... Well... We're all going to the temple anyway. Can't this wait till later? Uh, and Lilith's like, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna have to stop this. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have... There's nothing to be sorry about. I'm just not really sure what's going on. Uh, you're really thick-headed, then. My apologies. Big Blue's like, yeah, let's go. Alright. Alright. So. You see that up there? We don't want to take on that yet. Set that right. Another one of these tutorial fights. Come on. Why don't you use Lancet on it? What's a Lancet? Yeah, what is a Lancet? It's a skill that weakens enemies and heals the user. But when oh. Ronso uses it, that Ronso can sometimes learn Fiend's abilities. Oh. Hey, sounds cool. So, Kamari is basically your blue mage. Um, and you do that by using this little the Lancet ability, and now he's learned Sea Cannon. Now his overdrive gauge has already filled up, because as soon as you learn something new, you're good to go. Alright, so if you look, this guy is weak against fire. Alright, so let us go ahead and use the fire spell. Wham! Now he's not fully dead, so let's use that seat cannon. Alright. Okay, wham! <laughs> yeah, not not all. Eh, they're not all that powerful, but they are. They, some of them do come in quite useful late game. Um, and we'll go over that as we get closer to it. But there's a few that are that are definitely. Scout, I believe that is a weapon for Waka. It is. It has Ice Strike on it too. That is awesome. All right. So that's a that was a nice grab there. All right. Okay. So well, here we are with another one of those things. So let's not forget to do what we were going to do. So you and you defend. You to get in here. You defend. Waka get in here. And you I can take care of those alone, huh? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. And he overkilled it. Nice, nice. Alright, see how his boss like super cold now? It's like steaming. Like letting off the cold steam there. It's pretty nice. It's like the dry ice ball. Uh I'm a I'm a big fan of that. All right, so let's see here. There's more to grab. There definitely is. But you see, there's this thing here. Hey, you know what? You don't hit. There you go. Okay, Yuna. You instead of defending, you're gonna cure him. Alright. Ah, you were supposed to use that sooner. Ah, whatever. Alright, fine. Well, you know what? Forget it. There you go. And boom! You're dead. Alright, so these cool guys right here, these are elementals. Um, they can only be hit by magic, naturally, of their color, you know. Uh, late game, so, you know, you you'll get abilities where you won't have to use magic on these things anymore. But for the most part, you're, you're gonna have to use magic. All right. So you look, at, if you look up in the info there, you'll see that he is weak to water. He nullifies and absorbs the the uh, thunder, and he takes half damage from the other two. Anyone All right. Thirsty? So we just want to go ahead and kill him. There you go. All right. Get some spear levels. Got the seer ring. Eventually, that probably has like a poison ward on it. Hello. On our way, sir. On our way, sir. What are you doing? What's up? Training for the upcoming operation. Call us if you see any sin spawn. But what are sin spawn? Oh, what is that? Well, 
we are going to have to take care of that. I just kind of wanted to get a couple AP levels on the white belt before we did that. Um, <laughs> yeah. Just who do you think you are? <laughs> you guys hear that? That was awesome. That was one of the rare ones. You don't really hear that that much. At least I don't. Okay. He was like, yo, Yuna, Aeon. I'm like, whoa, easy killer. But, since he said it. You know what? Nah. <laughs> Alright. Let's just finish it up. Piece of cake. Okay, so I have quite enjoyed grinding around with you guys, but I guess it's time for us to go ahead and take on this Ocho and make our way up to those steps there. Alright, so we're gonna kinda we're gonna go at it from the front, because that's what I think we should do. Um, Focus on the fight. No worries. Yeah. Oh, you're weak to Ugin's ice. There you go. Get rid of him. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, let me know. Another thing that I wanted to ask you guys about. Oops, messed that up. Come. Yeah, let him come. All right. Another thing I wanted to ask you guys about was if there are any other games that you guys are interested in and in seeing me do. Uh, pretty much anything's on the table, but I don't do shooters. I don't particularly care for shooter games. Um, I'm, I'm uh, ex-military. I've actually lived one. I don't feel like I have to play one. Um, but that being said, um, just about anything else is on the table. Alright, so let's heal up here. Actually, let's save it up. Alright, black screen. I know. Alright. So, I, I decided that I'm going to try to keep these videos to about 20 to 30 minutes tops. I've seen the 45 minute videos that I've put up there, and they just seem way too long to me um and yeah i i just uh we're gonna keep that down so i actually have a timer set this time um and uh you know we're hanging out we're, we're doing what we're doing so it looks like from what we have left on the timer here it looks like we're gonna be getting about probably getting past this o2 here and then uh making our way to the steps and we'll probably stop right in front of the steps there and then we'll uh, do the temple next episode all right so let's go to the spear grid let's go ahead and learn some new stuff shall we all right mr. cry baby see look he's getting more speed and he's getting more magic points all right and then he's not getting nothing else and that sucks but he's right near extract speed okay Extract speed. So basically what that does is it will make... You use that on an enemy and it will make the enemy drop a speed sphere. Which is useful if you kind of get beat for drops. And you don't get a chance to do it. So silence attack. Good stuff. Alright. And we're going to get a little bit of a magic boost here. Nice. And one more. And Waka is going to hit harder because we got ourselves a nice strength increase here. All right. Kamari. Now, Kamari. We're going to come back to Kamari. Okay. So, we got to finish up the rest of this null spells here. Okay. Move one more there, get her some more MP. We like MP. Okay, so basically your mage type characters are going to get more evasion and more magic defense and, you know, more magic than they are anything else, really. Um, 
and it's the other way around for your melee characters, which would be naturally. So what you can do late game is you can take somebody, you know, like Lulu, and you can send her through Yuna's path, and you can send Yuna through Lulu's path, and get all the stat boost there, and just have your magic, like, completely maxed out. And you can do the same thing with, like, Waka and somebody else's path, and, you know, we're, we're gonna be... We're gonna be doing that, we're gonna be making this up. But Kamari, Kamari, Kamari. I have a tendency to mess up Kamari sometimes. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I totally have a, uh, a tendency to mess up Kamari. Um, so, you see this? His is dead smack in the middle of the grip, right? We can go up with it, and then we can send him through Crybaby's path here with a level one lock spear, right? And we're going to, uh, or we can go this way, we can send him through Yuna's path. <laughs> um, I wouldn't recommend doing that. You need a level 2 lock to do that anyway. Alright. But then, extract the mana, and then this Jinx, right? Now if we go here, we can send him through Lulu's path. That's something that I haven't tried before, um, because... I didn't really care for it. Now, and the other thing we can do is there's this other guy's path up here, which we haven't met this guy. Well, we, we haven't met him yet, but he, he is not with the party yet, so I'm not gonna speculate on that. If you can't put two and two together, then that's on you. But I would like to get Kamari to go through here. Um, so, to map that out, to make that happen, we would have to go up through Crybabies, use a level 2 lock here, catch it over here, and then work our way over from there. And then, yeah, yeah, so that, that, that's a thing. Right there, that would be a huge pain in the butt. Alright, so, but I think the safest bet, and I'm going to leave this up to you guys, to anybody that watches this and wants to know, I think the safest bet is to take him down here, use the lock here, and take him through Waka's path. Right? And if you take him through Waka's path, and then, you know, he'll get pretty fast, pretty accurate, and decent strength, and then, you know, we can catch him on the other guy's path. We can just kind of break him off, and he'll learn like a bunch of different stuff, you know? So, that's what we're gonna... I'm gonna make my way towards Waka's path with Kamari, but I'm gonna leave it up to you guys on where we actually go. Okay? Alright. Because I could always go back with him, too. You know, I got no problem grinding out a couple levels to take him back the other way. Maybe you guys want to do, like, a two white mage challenge or something like that, and you want me to send him through Yuna's path, then I will, you know? But, you know, it's really up to you guys. Um, I'm open to suggestions, definitely. Alright, but first things first, let's kill this thing. What, dude? What? I'm the coming to kill this us is Ochu, Lord of the Wood. Yeah? We've had trouble with this one before. Remember, discretion is the better part of valor. That's another word for saying run away. Standing guards. Yeah. yeah. What's up, man? The Ochu is no garden variety theme. We can throw a hundred crusaders at it and still lose. Yeah? Huh. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> Yeah, you better run. We can throw a hundred crusaders at it and lose. Yeah. It was darkness. It's me in the darkness. You missed. All right, let's lance at this guy. See if he's got something. Nope. Okay. Well. If he's vulnerable to fire, this is what we do. We cast fire. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Okay. And then we hit him too. But I'm thinking... Let's bring you in. Alright. We're gonna have the Suna. We're gonna need a Suna on the ready. Alright. So... 
go ahead and have her defend. And let's try to silence him. Maybe we can do that. There you go. I don't know if that actually does anything. Nope. But you see that? Alright. And then boom. We're not poisoned anymore. Yay. Okay. More fire. Kill it with fire. <laughs> okay. And let's bring Crybaby back in. Just get him a little face time. Um, you... Yeah, just hit it, I guess. Yeah, whatever, bro. <laughs> okay. And you need to... Why don't you get out of there, Kimari? Yeah, man. Hit him. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Lulu, kill it with fire. Yes. All right. Okay. And... Waka. Just hit him. Bam. <laughs> Okay. Get in there, Yuna. Do your thing. So, so basically, what Luzu and God are saying is that they're too scared to run up, on, run up on this thing. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna burn it to the ground because I have fire magic, and Lulu is awesome, and you're just not gonna win against me right now, Lord Ochu. You can call yourself Lord of the Wood all you want. Oh, there you go. All right, so he's going to start recovering hit points now. So this is what we do. All right. Get Lulu here. All right. Let's kill it with fire one more time. So he's sleeping. He's in regen, right? Now, what do we do in Final Fantasy games when something's asleep and we want to wake it up? So wake up. <laughs> Physical attacks and wake it up. Now, he's going to hit me with this. And that's gonna suck. Yeah, yeah, that sucked a little bit. But you missed. Okay, so I definitely could have gotten into some pretty deep water there. Um, so let's go ahead and stop playing around and call Valpor out here. Yes. Come to me, my giant monster. I have assumed the position. There you go. What's up, man? What is up, bro? Give me a puppy. Yeah, it's a good boy. It's a good monster. All right. There you go. Ha. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. Bam! Kill it with fire. Now what you gonna do? You gonna cast water? Really? That's it? That's what you're gonna do? You know what? I don't even have to hit you with an overdrive. I just beat you the old-fashioned way. I'll probably end up hitting you with an overdrive, but... More water? Ooh, yeah. Alright, guess what, brother? You're going down. You're going down like a sweet muffin with Fleur. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so look at that whammy! Overkilled that piece, and the reason why I wanted to overkill it is so that I can get a better drop. Um, basically, look at this. Got more AP, and got the Belladonna wand. What is that? I have a pretty good idea what that was. A summoner and her guardians. Very impressive. Yeah. Sir, we should fight too. Yeah, you we'll probably should soon enough. Yep. <laughs> you know, just keep running Young away from everything, bro. Okay. You know what? I am really excited to see what this Belladonna wand is, because if it's what I think it is, I'm going to be a very, very happy man. Oh, that is awesome. Okay. So, I just got dropped this Belladonna wand, which is great. So now Yuna basically has poison on hit. All right, uh, it doesn't always work, but it works most of the time. And I'm gonna show this off real quick before I cut the video, all right? And yeah, we're about the time where I probably should be cutting this video anyway, so let's show you how this works, ready? Bam, he's poisoned. <laughs> there was the fed, right? So now he, he's taking damage, right? So. That is awesome. Now, Yuna, Yuna's physical attack is, is kind of useful now. You know? 
Like it doesn't take any damage away, but it can it can poison something and you know make itself useful that way. So Bravo, that is why I wanted to use the Aeon to get the overkill on the O2 there. I knew that it was going to drop me something nice. I just wasn't 100% sure. I don't think I've got Waka out here yet. So before I actually kill this guy. Oh, the poison killed him. See, Yuna did that. Yuna did that. Me, big fan. Yeah, Waka didn't get no love on that one. Sorry, buddy. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and save it up. So let me know down in the comments which way you want me to take Kamari. Um, that is definitely something that we should discuss. Um, and another thing that we should be discussing is when do we want to start going hard on Blitzball? Because we are coming up to that point soon. And I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely loved the Blitzball minigame in this game. And I might actually do a second like series of it and we can go around and we can get you know some of the better is maybe like a side LP we can get some of the best people and you know win some cups and stuff and just play a heck of a lot of blitz ball so if that's up to you guys let me know if you're interested in that as well all right I'm going to go off of the feedback on that one all right so I'm going to go ahead and sign off here sneeze and miss prime saying goodbye and uh, you guys, uh, yeah, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.